This video app review is brought to you by the iPhoneAppReview.com. What's up, everybody? This is Luke Patrick with the iPhoneAppReview.com. We're seeing out yet another video review today, this time taking a look at an application called Vinsco, Vinscan, excuse me, barcode scanner, Vinscan barcode scanner. Um, that is kind of hard to say. Say it five times fast and uh, leave us a note in the comments box, I guess. I don't know what else you do. But uh, this application is geared towards those that deal with cars on a regular basis, so car salesmen, um, you know, car mechanics, people who are, uh, for whatever reason, constantly involved with cars and need to scan VIN numbers. If you don't know what a VIN number is, a VIN number is the specific number that's attached to each and every car that comes with a lot of information about the car. This is registered when the car is produced, and then I have every step along the way, it's updated with various things. So it's kind of like a social security number for your car, it's very important. And this app makes it very, very easy to uh, scan them. Uh, VinScan is free. We'll talk more about the pricing scheme in just a second. You have to uh, buy certain scan credits. But uh, overall, it's a pretty fantastic little application. I'm going to go ahead and show you the scanner, which looks something like this. Obviously, we're in a dark room. I don't have a, uh, an actual VIN number to scan, but the VIN number is usually contained either in the dash or in the side of the door of your car, and it's a little barcode, so you simply boot this thing up and then scan it and then um, you know away the app goes it does everything else that you would need it to do you've got a few other options along the bottom here um, for instance you can buy more scan credits which is what that button does um, you've got a few other items too you can actually enter the scan code manually which is what I had to do with my car um, if I can actually click this I'll show you the uh, the keyboard there you go and uh, we did like the fact that this is laid out with the numbers right above it. Uh, it's very easy to enter VIN, VIN numbers because they are a mix of, a, uh, of letters and numbers, so that's quite nice to have. All in all, you know, nice work there. Uh, what other features should I mention? Okay, so if you hit this one, it'll actually go to your saved cars, which is something that we're going to talk about right now, I guess. So there's my car, my Subi. Um, you can rename it if you'd like, so you can name it my car or whatever, and then uh, you have this, which is the, um, you know, the basic information about the car, and when I say basic, you get the basic, then you also get all kinds of other information about the car, which is really quite nice. The way that this is processed is really quite interesting, with the minute you scan the VIN number, away the, uh, the app goes, it gets all of this for you. And you don't have to enter a single thing. Likewise, then you just save it, and then it's stored onto the application. From there, you can email it, you can text it, you can phone it, you can save it, do whatever you want to with it. It's there, and it's ready to use. So let's say you're on the lot, and you have a question about a specific car. You can name it car on the left, uh, you know, Porsche in the corner, whatever. Then you load it up, you hit the button, and then here is all of the information that you have about that car. This is really kind of cool from just a car owner's perspective because uh, you know we're kind of we're kind of grease monkeys. I'll go ahead and admit it. And it's really just quite nice to uh, take a detailed look at your car. As you can see, the app has every single thing that you could ever want to know about your car, um, which is really quite nice. Yeah, all kinds of it, different information. Uh, you've got warranty information, images about the car. Um, that actually wasn't my car at the bottom. But that's a little. Uh, we can get over that. Engine type, drive type, trim level, fuel capacity, overall length, you know, all kinds of dimensions about the car, rim size, horsepower. Um, you know, no acceleration time on my Subi, I'm assuming that it really tests that. Towing capacity, all kinds of stuff, just a, you know, a wealth of information. So basically every single thing that you could ever want to know about your car. Um, which is nice. Again, you know, it's quick, it's simple, you scan it, especially if the uh, scan code is there, you simply scan it once and then all of that is retrieved for you. It's hardly a problem. Then, of course, it's saved in your saved vehicles, likewise your last hundred vehicles. If you need help and feedback, you can hit that. And, of course, there's an about explaining what the app does. The other, uh, you know, the only other thing that we really have to talk about with this application is the pricing scheme that comes through the scan credits. Scan credits come in packs of 10 and they cost a uh, basically a dollar each, 99 cents. And that gives you, of course, 10 scans. We aren't the biggest fans of this pricing scheme. We think it's, uh, you know, we would have much rather have paid an initial upfront fee than be allowed to scan unmetered, even if that was, like, say, 30 bucks. Um, we have a feeling most of the people who are actually going to be using VinScan would assume the same thing, just because uh, they'll be scanning quite a lot, and if they're out in a car lot or something, you know, they're going to be doing this a lot. So, uh, though we have, you know, a few problems with that, we also don't really like the interface as much as we feel like we should. 
It's not the most gorgeous interface we've ever seen. It's entirely functional, which is something that we would expect of a work-ready application. At the same time, uh, we feel like it could be streamlined a little bit better. Then again, we don't have any specific suggestions there, so we, we won't say too much about that. All in all, though, VinScan is the perfect application for someone that needs this kind of functionality from their iPhone. As such, the uh, you know the price is right, uh, and 99 cents for a total of 10 scans is not bad. You get a discount if you buy more, etc., etc. So all in all, VinScan is going to get a 3.5 out of 5 star rating from us here at the iPhoneAppReview.com. And uh, you know that's pretty much all I have to say about it. So at this point, I'm going to go ahead and sign out. But we'll see you guys later. Bye.